Hey, young people. Uh, every once in a while, Smarter Every Day does some gun videos. I mean, he's fired some AKs underwater. He's done, he got slow motion cameras. In this video, he does some Nose pretty on. cool stuff. He went to museum, and in this museum, there was two bullets that hit back from 1862 that hit in midair, and they fused together. So he wanted to see if he could recreate this. And he does some great slow motion. Uh, they get all these things together. They try different lead, different... Uh, I mean, it's a really good video. They got electrical charges. He talks about lock time, how a trigger works. They wanted to change this to an electronic trigger. So he made it an electronic trigger so they could fire them at the same time and actually get bullets facing each other and hitting each other. So, if you want to go watch this video, I would recommend it. I mean, I like what he does, but he shows it in slow motion. It's it's a pretty long video. It's like 35 minutes. But he covers some pretty interesting thing, and I think it's pretty... He usually does a pretty good job anyway. Uh, I, I don't want to show his footage, but when these things hit, it's pretty freaking cool. So I'm going frame by frame. And he's got it slowed down. See if I can at least show a little bit. When these two things hit. Pretty cool. He gets better. They do about four or five. And at the end they shoot a couple of uh, titanium things and different things. Uh, like aluminum, titanium, and I forgot what the other one was. But anyway... Uh, there's a lot about ballistics. The only thing that he didn't do, if somebody knows him, I think his name's Justin. If somebody knows him, I tried to get him one time to do a video on a horse bit on the amount of forces on leverage. And uh, when you pull on reins on a on a bit that's in a horse's mouth, how much pressure exerted on the jaw and the leverage and, and how much how bad bits are. And I never heard back from him either. He didn't get it or he didn't want to do it. And maybe he didn't want to piss off people. He does things pretty neutral. And he would piss off people that use bits if he did that video. So, uh, anyway, the only thing I would have liked him to do on this video is I would have liked him to fire a heavier bullet at a lighter bullet because he uses the exact same thing on both bullets. They reload and do everything. I want to see the difference between mass, a bigger bullet, and a smaller bullet hitting at the same velocity. And then I want to see what happens when velocity... On the bigger bullet is increased, and then what happens when the velocity on a smaller bullet is increased? I would have loved to see that experience. So maybe if enough guys go over there and tell him that, he will recreate that. Uh, anyway, and that there, good watch. You want to go watch it? Bullings hitting slow motion, uh, smarter every day, 287. All right, y'all have a good one.